mừng năm mới Và xin đến khoai lơ chúc mừng năm mới Chúc mừng năm mới Chúc mừng năm mới Vạn sự như ý Đây chúng ta cho xin đến khoai lơ These are the lovely wishes from the Vietnamese community living and working in Taiwan, along with their families, friends, and Vietnamese language learners. As Tet approaches, those who are far from home can't help but miss their homeland, where they have family and cherished memories and the traditional customs that are deeply ingrained, on the occasion of the Lunar New Year. Vietnam Plus would love to share clips from the Vietnamese community in Taiwan on how they celebrate Tet in a foreign land. As international students on winter break, we also work part-time jobs, leaving us with limited time for Tet celebrations. We miss the moments of bonding with family, cleaning the house, making chuong cakes, tidying the ancestral altar, and most importantly, enjoying a reunion meal together. The moment I cherish the most is when my family gathers, goes to the Lunar New Year market, buys chuong cakes, and has small family gatherings with relatives from both sides of the family. No matter where you are, just having chung cake makes it feel like Tet. This year's joy is doubled for me because can come here to celebrate Tet. This is a huge joy for me. Even though there are traditional markets in Taiwan selling a lot of Tet gifts, it's a bit different from the Tet market atmosphere back home. I really miss the moments when my family and I went to the market and bought peach branches and kumquat pots to decorate our home. These are memories I cherish a lot while being away from home. When celebrating Tet away from home, we also want to have the taste of our homeland, so we often visit Vietnamese and Asian grocery stores to buy essential ingredients for cooking, such as fish sauce, rice vermicelli, and fermented shrimp sauce. I bought banh chung, Vietnamese sausage, and spring rolls so that if we have time during Tet, we can enjoy them while calling our family to share joyful moments. However, it's not as complete as back home. Someone wraps bon chung, someone else wraps candies. That sharing spirit is very precious during this Tet holiday. My friends and I have prepared a tray of five fruits and went shopping for new clothes. Now, we're looking for a Vietnamese store to buy bon chung. I miss friends and family a lot. I remember the moments of wrapping and boiling bon chung with my parents and siblings. Those were warm feelings. Also, I wish everyone a great year of the dragon to bring lots of luck.